Hey guys, what's up? I'm Jules. Thanks for coming back for another video. This is a little bit of a surprise end of the year, end of 2020 video uh, because I am ridiculously excited. Yesterday I got an email from my local needlework shop, a stitching shop, blah, blah, that came out, a needlework store, local needlework store, a stitching shop here in Denver, Colorado and said, guess what? Roll of frame is in. Roll of frames are in, which if you don't know my channel, I actually have a roller frame. I've been using it for the last about six months or so, and I love it. I adore it, and um, I love Dan, who makes, who hand makes all the products. Uh, I just want more. I just want more. I'm greedy. Uh, I will say this right now. If you are looking to get some extra pieces for a roller frame or to get a roller frame, I highly recommend a stitching shop. They order their products on a monthly basis. Christine there told me that she's Every month she places an order, so she's always got stuff in the works so that hopefully the new products are rolling in as quickly as Dan can make them. So um, I definitely recommend there. When I was there today, because uh, I, I had to go over and stop over there today and pick up uh, some product, and uh, uh, there, there were still pieces there. There were still uh, roller bars. There were still um, scroll, frame, or scroll bars. There were still end bars um, of different sizes. Uh, but I wanted to show you guys what I picked up today because if you've been following me for a while, you know I have been waiting and waiting for these to come in. I'm super excited that they're in now. So just to show you real quick, if you're not familiar with sort of the pieces that I'm talking about, there are the end bars, um, which come in a variety of different sizes. These are 12 inches. And um, so you got the two end bars. Well, you need a set of, of two. So you've got actually here and here, what we call end bars. And then you got the scroll rods, which is what you obviously roll your stuff on and they come in a variety of different lengths this one is where is it 18 oh I did that wrong I have that look at that I have that wrong I should have red and red on the same side well that may be why I'm not getting it as tight as I should I thought I had done that right but anyway so this is an 18 incher and um, but I have been really really wanting to get different sizes because I need to put more projects on the roll of frame. I'm stitching faster, uh, stitching easier, and I'm really enjoying it uh, for a lot of reasons. But uh, this is something that I'm really looking forward to in 2021, getting a lot of stitching progress done. So with that being said, what did I get today? So I got, uh, let's see, 40 inch. I got a 40 inch set of roller bars. I want, I want to say roller bars. It's not roller bars. It's scroll bars. And then I got the a roller set, I should say. And then a 45-inch Mondo-sized. Mondo-sized. So what am I going to do? What am I going to do with these? Um, so I think, I think what I'm going to at least start out doing, I absolutely am going to put Rainy Water Replace on one of these, on one of these scrolls. Now, I checked it out to see if they would fit the smaller um, scroll rods, and they do. So I can put a project, put this on that one. Um, and you guys can see I've got about a quarter of it left to go. And I think I'm going to fly to finish to finish this. The other one, I actually wanted to do one of my own pieces. So I'm looking at, oh yeah, and by the way, I also got some fray check. I'll show you that in a second um, to finish up the edges here. But I actually want to do Empire State Workers. This is also long enough to go on either one of these scroll frames. So I'm going to definitely put that on there as well. And I think that's what I'm going to start with in terms of these new scroll rods. I believe that that is how we're going to start because I want to do one of my own designs and I want to do something that I have been working on for a very long time and need to finish. Now I also got more end bars. I got 10 inch end bars and 12 inch end bars and I don't really know for sure exactly which one I, 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 I no, I should say I'll probably use the 12 inch so that there's more space between them uh, for rainy waterloo place and the 10 inch one for um, uh, the Empire State Workers and then I also got another set hold on there's a sets galore I got an 8 inch as well something else to try um, who knows, maybe that's Empire State Workers, but the reason why I got one more set of end bars is because, <laughs> oh, 
thank you, I apologize, um, is because I also have Dachshund up on this, and I want to get Dachshund going as well. So um, if you guys thought that just because I started my own design store that I wasn't going to stitch other cross-stitch stuff, no, not at all. Absolutely continuing to stitch all the patterns that I have loved over the last so many years, things that, uh, that I really enjoy most. I just want to do fun patterns. And then I got fray check. And so, so this is to basically get the, um, here we go, the frayed edges of my uh, stuff because I didn't serge this. I just, I kind of cut it from fabric I already had. And uh, so anyway, so that's it. That's, that's all I wanted to say really. I was super excited about it. And um, I'm gonna work on uh, trying to get these all together. It takes a while. So I'll likely show you all of this uh, during my next floss tube next week, the first one of 2021. So thanks guys so much for watching. I hope you're as excited about 2021 in stitching as I am. And um, oh yeah, by the way, I tried um, streaming this morning on Twitch and literally like so many things came together in a bad way. Um, not in a bad way, just in a like, we had like two big deliveries that were coming and then I had to end up going into work for some stuff. And then just, I, just so many things going on this morning, I was completely distracted. And all I did was play with a puzzle for almost the whole stream. It was kind of ridiculous. And I know it was boring and not what people usually come there for. So I am streaming again in the morning. I'm going to stream. I'm going to get up early. I'm going to stream early for at least a couple of hours. And I'll have uh, one of these projects up. And we're going to get a lot of progress made. So bring your stitching. Come along. And let's have fun. And uh, take care. Happy New Year. And I'll see you in 2021.